So, Larry is messaging me today. I've been pestering him for a long time to ask me questions because he's very bad at it. He loves to just talk and talk and talk and tell you and tell you and tell you and we've looped back into that phase of the discussion. We are back in the circle of blame shaming. I, I guess you should just apologize for yelling, but it just, I don't, it just keeps happening. And if I apologize at this point, is he even going to believe me? <sighs> He's basically decided because one time I was insulted, he interpreted my anger as yelling, so he yelled back, and now I deserve homelessness and all of the things that that entails. The fear of being put out on the street, the street where if I do not find a legal place to sleep, the police will come for me. Larry has decided I deserve jail because I am not mature enough to not be insulted when I am insulted. I don't have the energy to like read this at the camera or something. I have all of the screenshots of our conversation and I'm going to put them on my Patreon. If you give a fuck enough about me and my mental health to like watch these videos, at least consider clicking the link to my Patreon. The engagement helps. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, whatever. Help support me in this shithole I found myself in because my father is an idiot who cannot admit that he thinks I deserve jail because I got insulted when he insulted me. The insult was, he said, every single one of my friends who's doing something online for their Patreon is wasting their time and they'd be better off doing nothing. All of these strangers he's never talked to about what they're uploading to Patreon, what they're doing on Instagram, what they're doing on YouTube, they all would be better doing nothing. They should just go get a real job, disregard the fact that most of the people I was talking about have like two fucking jobs and do stuff online to try and get Patreon going. He would not listen. I tried to explain it to him reasonably, and because of my argument, my reasonable argument, he took that as an offense and started yelling, so I started yelling back. And so, because I would not stop yelling in the face of a bunch of other people yelling at me, I deserve jail. And he cannot admit that that is what his actions are saying, because he's not saying it with his words. And as long as he never says it with his words, everything's fine because he's being polite he's being nice so he's being nice he's giving me a chance all i have to do is apologize for yelling when everyone's yelling at me and promise to never yell again when everyone is yelling at me fuck larry he's not even gonna watch this video he never watches any of them